Hey guys, it is another rainy day in New York, which is like ridiculous. It has rained so much lately, but today is the perfect day to show you our new science experiments slash sensory slash Christmas activities. I'm going to do five. I literally didn't plan this until like maybe a couple hours ago. So everything you should mostly have on hand to do these and they're simple, easy, and cheap the name of my game so the boys are watching home alone right now having some apples and granola bars and i'm gonna set it up let's get our science on Cameron and I are setting up our cookie cutter volcanoes. I did this for Halloween in this Halloween sensory video and it was a huge hit. All you really need is baking soda and vinegar. And I did add food coloring just to keep it a little bit festive, but really you could do this with just baking soda and vinegar. And you're basically going to fill up as much as you can your cookie cutters and then add a few drops of food coloring in there. And that's it guys. Essentially what you're really going to do is take, I actually used a turkey baster in this one, and filled a cup up with some white vinegar, and then they're going to learn to squeeze the water up and try to squirt it in so they make mini volcanoes in the shape of whatever the cookie cutter is. Okay, so now you're going to squeeze this ball yeah. in here and it's going to come up, see? And then you're going to squeeze it to let it out. Okay? So now you're going to drop it in here. But very carefully. Go ahead. Yeah. Very carefully. Okay. Now let go. There you go. Did it fill up? Yeah. Okay. Now very carefully drop it in here. Drop it in the train. What's happening? It's getting a volcano. That's it. Now that's it. Whoa! <laughs> Go ahead. Yes, yeah, slowly I did. Very slowly. And this works on their motor skills too. Go ahead. Whoa! You poured a little too much, but that's okay. Whoa! That was a big volcano. That was a big volcano. Okay, now it's Cammy's turn. Do it. Squeeze. There you go. And it'll come up. Let go. Like this, baby. Ready? Squeeze. And then let go. No, no, no. No, no, Let go. See? And it'll come up. See? Now drop it into the gingerbread. Whoa! Whoa! Wow. So now what happens when we added the vinegar? And it'll do it again, right? What happened? Wow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do. What happened when we added the vinegar? Uh, it, it goes. Yeah. Okay, try to keep it in the tree. There we go. Everyone get some jingle bells and start building with your blocks. So tell me, where does it stick? Are you trying to look that one stuck? Are you trying to do it? Go ahead, Cam. Oh, you trying to pick it up? Trying to make it stick? <gasps> you got it! Yeah. You did get it. Slip it over. I want to see what happens. Can you do that? We have to see what happens. It sticks. Now pick it up. Does it fall off? Oh, it's stuck. See? What happened? What happened to the bell? Why does it stick? My, my, this thing was stuck in my thing. Yeah. Now, Ty Ty, look. Double. You ready? <gasps> Whoa! Is that cool? Yeah. Whoa! That's really cool. Now, why does it happen? Do you remember what I said? Whoa, it's stuck. Be careful, they will come off. That's pretty cool, right? Jingle bell blocks. Oh, wow. 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 That's okay. This is a tiny 
tiny bit advanced and that's why you keep hearing me say like what happened what is it because i'm trying to reinforce it they're not quite there i mean we're three and four but you know what it's never too early to start that science aspect of your kids learning okay so i literally went to the dollar store sorry for the green food coloring i went to the dollar store this is little erasers that they had in like a pack and then i just grabbed a cookie cutter some Christmas tree balls from the dollar store. These bells, which I used in the magnetiles, I'm also using here. And then I just ripped different sizes. And then of course, candy canes. This plate literally was all from the dollar store except the cookie cutter, which I already had. All right, my boys, you ready for sink or float? Yeah. Which one do you want to do first? Okay, now wait, 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 wait. You can do it. Grab it, Ty. Now, is it gonna sink or float? Ty, Alex, sink or float? Wait, do not put it in yet. Sink or float? Sink. You think it'll sink? Ty, Ty, sink or float? I think I it will sink. float. Sink? You think it'll float? Wait, Tyler. Cameron, sink or float? Go. Float. Okay, let's go. Did it? Yes, float. That's right, it floats. Here, Alex, you want an eraser too? The green weight? Green one? Yeah. Okay, are they good? Ty, Ty, sink or float? Wait, don't do it. Sink. Alex? Sink. Sink. Cammy, sink or float? Float. All right, put it in. Let's see. Oh, what happened? It sank. It sank. It sank. Okay. And They sank. That's right. They did not float. So, so far, what's the only thing that's floating? That's right, it went down, so it sank. So what's the Mommy, only thing floating so far? Um, what's the only thing floating? Um, the uh, bells. Not the bells, the Christmas ball. That's what's floating. Games. Don't put it in yet. Sink or float? Sink. Float. You think they're going to float? Okay, Cammie, it's sink or float? No. All right, let's put it in. It floats. No. Does it sink or float? Float. No, where is it? It's on the ball. So what does that mean? It sank. It sank. That's right. Yeah. In the way. Okay, so everything sank except for the Christmas balls. Something that interesting that happened here. What happened to the water? It's white. Is it it's kind of white? It's kind of pink. Is it the same color it was before? Does it look cloudy? Yeah. yeah. And what happened to the candy canes? Do they look the same? Yeah. Yeah. They no. broke. They're they're shrinking because all of the color and the sugar is breaking down in the water. You see? You almost stop. You almost can't see anymore, right? Yeah. yeah. My hand got wet. That's right. Your hand got wet. Look, it's all cloudy. Yeah. You see? Because the sugar yeah. broke down. The next thing that we're gonna do is called magic milk. Magic milk, all we need is some milk and you're gonna pour it in. Okay, so now everyone has their milk. Not gonna be as exciting because I'm running out of food coloring. So all I have is yellow, green, and black, but we're gonna work with it. Nice. Is put a few drops nice. right in the center or you could have your kids do it. Do one squirt. You ready? Come on, yeah. use your hand. One, two, three. Whoa. What happened? I got. Alex, you do it. I got blue now. One squirt. Whoa. It got green. And what happened? Is it still Whoa. swirling? Yeah. Why? What happened? Do you know? Yeah. Yeah. Why? Why does it do that? Because. The milk is magic. Because <laughs> the milk has fat in it and the soap is separating it. So that's really cool, right? But what happened to all the colors? Uh, they all swirled around, right? Yeah. That's really cool. The first thing that we're going to set up is fake snow. I thought this would be so cute. Um, and guess what? You could totally do this for Elf on the Shelf if you do that. And it would be so cute. We're definitely going to do it. 
but there's a few ways to make fake snow. Just you got to work with it. So I use cornstarch and equal parts. Well, it's actually not equal, but it should be around equal parts of lotion. Try to use white lotion so it stays like snow. And I just had Miss Myers. I think it was like the winterberry scent. But if you use plain lotion, you could use uh, like peppermint extract or something like that to entice that smell. So you're basically going to keep adding your lotion until you see it start to come together almost like a snowball, like you can pack a snowball, and then it should crumble apart. So I wanted it to be a little bit more dense because I wanted them to be able to use it also in cookie cutters or pack it like snowballs or whatever they wanted to do. Another side note is I actually set this activity up first because I put it in the refrigerator um, so it felt cold. So that's another thing to do and this is probably the most prep work you're gonna have to do for any of the activities that we have. So Alex just asked me to do, and this is so cool. Alex, it almost looks like the North Pole, right? Yeah. You're making Christmas trees and snowmen's in there? Tasha, what are you doing? That, that's that's not jolly toys. That's ornaments. Those are ornaments. Yeah. Cammy, what are you doing over here? So uh, here, let Cammy get some. This is cool science. This is cool science. Yes. You like science. it? So now, what was your favorite out of everything? Um, the book, the the equipment. The erasers. The erasers? Yeah. Kids oh. love erasers, guys. Yeah, because we're boys. This has to be the quickest sensory slash science experiment video I've ever done, but it was literally on the fly. I had whatever I had in the house, and we made it work because it was so gross out. So let them play with their snow. And that's it, guys. I hope you love this video. If you give, do, give it a big thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And we will see you soon. We are just doing more holiday traditions and festivities. So, Merry Christmas, and let's Merry have a... Merry Christmas, my friends! Merry Christmas, my friends! Have a great holiday.